USS Newport News, CA-148, the final Des Moines-class heavy cruiser in the U.S. Navy, was commissioned in 1949 and was renowned as the Navy's last active all-gun heavy cruiser and the first fully air-conditioned surface ship. From 1950 to 1961, Newport News participated in Mediterranean deployments, major fleet exercises, and training cruises in the Caribbean and Western Atlantic. Noteworthy events included serving as Vice Admiral Ralph Alofsky's flagship in the Mediterranean in 1956 and aiding earthquake survivors in Morocco in 1960. During the Cuban Missile Crisis in 1962, Newport News played a vital role as the flagship for the Atlantic Fleet and participated in actions near Cuba. The years from 1963 to 1974 were marked by NATO exercises, amphibious drills, and significant involvement in the Vietnam War. Newport News conducted naval gunfire support missions, notably Operation Sea Dragon, engaging in 156 strikes against North Vietnamese coastal sites. The ship's heroic actions earned her the nickname, the Grey Ghost from the East Coast. During her Vietnam deployments, she fired 59,241 rounds and endured enemy fire on multiple occasions. In 1972, an explosion in her turret resulted in casualties, yet she continued active duty until 1974. Decommissioned in 1975, Newport News was eventually sold for scrap in 1993. Her legacy lives on in the USS Salem Museum and Memorial Foundation dedicated to preserving artifacts and memories of the ship's service. The cruiser's remarkable history encompasses numerous awards and commendations, exemplifying her valor and contribution to U.S. naval operations.